Hey y'all, it's Courtney and I am back with another video and today I have some fun stuff to show you guys. Um, one of my friends sent me some cool stuff to review. So, first, I'm going to say this. If anybody out there is having a really hard time for Christmas this year, because I know that a lot of people are having a very rough time, um, and you want to get some Christmas gifts for free, um, hit me up on Twitter, okay? Um, because I could help you out in that situation. Um, I never really thought about this before because every group that I review for, they're like, hey, if you have a friend or two that you think would be good at this or whatever, send them our way. Um, so if you are having a tough time this Christmas season, hit me up on uh, my Twitter. It's at CourtneyMarks04. Um, just come find me and uh we'll talk so anyways um i love doing these reviews you guys know that so um i have two things to review today um they all came from the same place i got this yesterday it's um nyx filler instinct instead of killer instinct i think that's pretty funny i hate that though that you have to be really easy because I don't want this color to get down in my lipstick. So what I do is I just go like that. Barely touch it. But then I need to wipe this off before I stick it back in there. I'm just going to stick it right here. Because I don't want that color down in my lip gloss. Whew. Why did I wipe that on my hand? It's got cayenne pepper in it. Anyways. So let's get into this. First off, I'm going to show you guys something that I got for Autumn. And, um, so it's a kid's digital camera. I didn't even know that they had this one or I would have tried that one. But I thought this one was so cute anyways. I didn't even ask if they had a girl one or, I mean, boy, girl. But, you know, it doesn't matter anyways. Um, oh my gosh, this one's cute too. I think that one's supposed to look like an elephant. And then this one's a cat, and then the one that I got is the little monster. That little cat's pretty cute, too, though. Um, oh, that's cute. It says, you're my best love. We will always love you. Oh, so there's four. Okay. So it's looking like there is, well, actually, <clears throat> there's six. There's a pink monster, a blue monster, a blue elephant, a pink elephant, a blue cat, and a pink cat. So that's cool. They're really cute too. And they're like perfect size for kids' hands. Um, so yeah, I'm going to open this up and show it to you guys. And uh, if anybody's interested, I can put a link to these products down in my, um, either in my description or in my, um, I'll put it in a post or a um, comment. So, this was $26.99. Look how cute. It's, like, perfect for a little kid's hand, too. So, the reason why I got this for Autumn is because the whole COVID thing, you know, they're only going to school two days a week. Um, they don't have as much time to spend with their little friends this school year. So, oh, I almost just ripped that off. <sighs> the little screen protector. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to let her take this to school with her and, um, get some memories, and then we're going to make all of her little school friends, because there's only 12 kids in the class, so we can print out 12 of each picture, um, and I think we're going to make little scrapbooks for each kid for this school year, so, we'll, you know, we'll put, we'll put their names on the begin or the front page, and just something nice to do, because this year has sucked, so, so, it comes with First off, this is a um, micro SD that holds the um, pictures, obviously. Um, I'll have to look at the directions. I'm sure it says how you got to do all that stuff. And it looks like you can even take this rubber piece off. Yeah, you can actually. Okay, so you can take this rubber piece off completely. And then it's just like this, but you probably want to leave it on because this doubles as a um, protector. Kids drop things a lot, so I'm going to leave hers on. 
as much as possible. But that's really cool that it's actually, um, you can actually take it off if you need to, to, you know, clean up the camera or whatever. Oh, hold on. I hear my child. Um, what are you doing? I want to sign up. I want to sign up for this link. Of course, she's going to start because she knows I have something in here that, you know, I don't want her to see. So, she's going to drive me crazy the whole time. So, anyways, um, so yeah. There's the camera. Then it comes with these little clips. Because, you know, little kids drop things, so they can just put it around their neck right like this. And here's this, um, the picture button power button, the over button, or the up and down button, um, this is for brightness up and down, and this is for the view, or like the, um, either panoramic, or, well, there's not panoramic, but you know what I'm saying, landscape, or, um, selfie, or whatever, so that it's really easy to use, it's really user-friendly, um, I don't want to use it right now, well, let's see, can I plug this in, so it comes with a cord, course and um, let's see where the charging port is okay so you do have to take it all out of there the cats are climbing his guitar the cat's been climbing his guitar case so you can put it in here and um, plug it in and there she is charging and then the power button. Look. Oh, cool. So there's a bunch of stuff you can do on here. That's really neat. So there is the video. Okay, so you got to do the up and down. So there's camera. There's settings. Okay, and then that's over. There's video. This is watching the videos, I'm guessing. This is, what is this? Okay, how do you, so is that okay? Um, that, okay. So kids cam. This button takes you back to home. Wait, how do I click? And then what do I click? Do I click the shutter to get to the games? Yeah, it's got snake on it. Or Tetris. Push box. Cool. I I had no idea that it had games on it. That's super cool. So yeah, Snaker, Petrus, and Pushbox. Super cool. Start. Oh, game over. <laughs> um, I don't know how this works. So I think you have to get to those dots. But anyways. Oh. Okay, now let's go back to home. Alright, there's the home button. Let's see what this is. Kids cam. Alright, so we're going to get done with this because here comes my kid again. Yes, Autumn. Alright, hold on. She almost caught me. Alright, so. I'm going to hurry up and hit it in the bathtub. So, 
the next thing, and if you guys want to see a more in depth um, with that camera, let me know. Um, but this is really fun, and I'm going to make a video just using this by itself. Um, so this is a hair cutting kit. Yay! Remember how I told you guys I wanted to cut my hair? I think I'm going to do it myself. So this is one of those combs that has the razor blades inside that you just kind of to kind of um, give like a choppy look, which is what this, I will be using this on my bangs whenever I do my bangs, because I told you guys like how I did the red in the front, I wanted to do, like frame my face, well, this is what I'll probably be using on that, um, I'm gonna look up how to use them, um, you know, really good, because I don't want to mess it up, obviously, um, but that's what that looks like, I'm looking for the brand name on these, but I don't see it. If I find it, I'll let you guys know. Um, and then this, of course, is for after you're done. Yeah. The hair off of you. That's really soft. Oh my god, that's soft. That's really nice. Man, I'd use that for my makeup. There's that. Then this, I believe, is for sharpening. For sharpening? Is that... Or not sharpening, but, like, it's for the blade. I know it's for the blade. It's, like, corduroy... Or not corduroy, but, like, thick velvety type stuff. I don't know. Maybe corduroy? I don't know. What is this for? Anybody that's out there and cuts hair. Um, it came with a couple clips for putting your hair to the side or, you know, keeping the other hair out of the way while you're cutting. Um, is this a sharpening key? I think. I'm not positive. But I know it's for something with the blades as well. Pretty sure. Then, comes with comb. Just a regular comb. And then, this goes, there's a little slot for this to go in there. So, we're going to Stick that down in there. I didn't even realize it came with that, with the little comb thing. But I'm glad I know now, because that's awesome. And then, um, oh, it also comes with this, which is a cape. It comes with a whole ass cape with it, too. That's awesome. So, I'll definitely be using this. I wish I would have had this one I pick, uh, cut Patience's hair. That would have been awesome. These are so pretty, too. I don't want to rip it, so I wanted to stick it back down in there, but there we go. These are really pretty. Has my birthstone in them, even? I think these are, like, the Japanese, um, not steel. Is it Japanese steel? Here. This is really dumb. I don't know why I'm doing this, but. Oh, that's not what this is for, but. Ooh. This is for. This is the thinning shears. They're really nice. They're so pretty, too. I love the black. Now, they have a, another um, set of these, but they are. Um, the Japanese steel, I think it's Japanese steel, um, but they're just the regular silver, but I wanted this set, um, they're, they were about the same price, this set was $27.99, um, and it had all this with it, or you could just get the really, like, professional set, um, that was just the regular silver, and, um, it came with just the straight shears, um, I think it came with a cape as well, and the key, came with a key like this, and then, what, uh, there was one other thing that it came with, I think the comb, but I wanted specifically the thinning shears, I wanted these, um, 
but it came with just those few things and it was $23.99. So there's a little bit of a quality difference um, because with a professional set, you're going to be using them day in, day out, day in, day out, day in, day out. So obviously you're going to need a really, you know, not quality because these are quality as well. These are beautiful. Um, they're still like the Japanese steel, I'm pretty sure. Um, but what am I trying to think? Heavy duty. Um, they're, I think they're a little more thick and like around these parts. Um, because obviously you don't want to break them, but for just like in your own home using these, they said these will last for years, probably a couple decades. Because I asked them, I'm like, well, you know, if I get the silver ones, are they better quality? Um, will these break? And he was like, no. He was like, literally, if you're just going to be using these for in your house, they'll last you probably till your kids are grown. I was like, okay, that's all I needed to know. But the other ones, like I said, they're just a little heavy du more heavy duty because they are for professional settings. Um, so they're a little thicker in the places that, you know, scissors tend to break. And I just love that it has that blue my birthstone now the brand is um ebu ebu i but live without the e it's i b u t l i v all capitals did you because you didn't see that yeah i b u t l i v really pretty just very nice um and i'm also going to do a video using these specifically oh i think i said that already that i was talking about the other thing um the other thing i'm going to keep that you know up because that's obviously going to be a gift um but if you guys want to know how that works a little more mm. wow Whew. That was ridiculously easy. It didn't even close all the way before I cut it. <laughs> I don't mind cutting my little baby hairs a little bit. Watch. I mean, I didn't even close the scissors all the way. They're not even closed all the way. Wow. Those are really nice. I cannot wait to use those thinning shears on um, my face around my face um so yeah once again $27.99 for the whole set you get the thinning shears the straight the straight um scissor comb the brush to brush off your shoulders this to I think it's to sharpen the scissors um Two clips, the um, thinning comb, I guess, I don't know exactly what it's called, razor comb, the carrying case, the key, and the, um, the cape. I think that's pretty fucking awesome, especially because they're such good quality. I don't know if I'm going to put these back in their little cases or not. I don't think I, eh, maybe. I probably don't need to, but I don't know. They're so pretty. I just want to keep them nice as long as possible. They're just so nice. Wow. Keep them in here because there's a lot of moisture in my house. So I'd like to keep them not moist or not damp because they will be staying in my bathroom, obviously. Um, so let's set these in here. And then we'll put this in here. Mike's getting mad because the cats are messing with each other. The one's sleeping and Poppy keeps getting up there and jumping on her. <laughs> He's like, leave her alone right now. I'm going to beat your...